Hello, my beautiful Geminis. This is your February 2023 monthly zodiac reading for the sign of Gemini. Spirit, what are the angel numbers for Gemini placements for February 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What are the angel numbers for Gemini placements, Spirit, for February 2023? Angel numbers for my beautiful Gemini placements for February 2023. For the beautiful Gemini placements. Mm. Spirit's definitely got something to talk about today, Gemini. Let's see. What do we got for gems? Number 26, I am tactful. You have a desire to succeed and will feel most accomplished when your work benefits others. Your intuitive awareness of what people want allows you to come up with innovative solutions to meet their needs. Number five, I am adaptable. Flexibility is your forte. When life throws you a curveball, you can easily adapt to new circumstances and find excitement in the unexpected change. Be brave and bold in your endeavors. Okay. And zero, 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 I am a creator. You are one with the creator and there are no limits to what you can achieve. You have the ability to create something new and incredible in your lifetime here on earth. Zero, 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 I am a, cre I am a creator. Messages from Spirit for Gemini placements, February 2023. What are the messages from Spirit for Gemini placements, February 2023? Messages from Spirit, Gemini placements, February 2023. What are the messages from Spirit for my Gemini? If you're wondering if this will happen, the answer is no. So something's not going to happen. I don't know if it's good or bad, but it was, it's not going to happen. Everything is everything happens for a reason. You will soon understand why. So something's not working out for you for the better of you. Feels like protection here. And spirit is, is ready to offer you guidance. All it requires is an open mind and a request for assistance. Okay, so... We got some changes. You're, you're, it's easy for you to adapt to things um, you sh or you should embody the energy of adapting to change because um, the desire you have to succeed and accomplish things to help with others, I feel like it's strong, but spirit thinks you need some guidance. If, if you're ready, they're ready, right? Spirit messages for Gemini placements for February 2023. What are the spirit messages for Gemini placements for February 2023? Spirit messages for Gemini placements for February 2023. What are the spirit messages for Gemini placements for February 2023? The spider. You are the maker and keeper of your own destiny. So... <laughs> Wow, what a way to start. And then you have the moth. Be aware, you could be hiding from yourself. And the snail. Self-love and self-care above everything else. Wow. You have a really serious decision to make about something, Gemini. And I feel like... Or not the decision, but like a realization of something. Because you want to achieve, your desire to be successful is strong. And, excuse me, I feel like you're a creator. And there's some things that's about to kind of change on you. But self-love and self-care above everything else, you have to do what's right for you. Spirit is stressing that energy. But remember, you could be hiding from yourself. Like you're not, you're not living to your fullest potential. You are the keeper and the maker of your destiny. So if you're not living to your fullest potential, then that's on you. So let's see. What are the tarot cards for Gemini placement spirit for February 2023? What are the tarot cards for Gemini placement spirit for February 2023? What are the tarot card spirit for Gemini placements, February 2023? Let's see what this is about. Three of Wands, Two of Wands, Page of Cups, the Lovers, that's your energy, the Magician, and the Ten of Wands. You are definitely carrying some burdens here that are not yours. Like, seriously. I feel like... You have you're very hesitant about moving on from something, almost like you really don't want to tell somebody how you truly feel about the situation. You rather just carry the burden and carry the load with you, and that's the problem. Okay, whatever you're manifesting here requires you to drop the baggage. You have to drop the baggage. 
it's not going to help you out in any way. If you want to know how to go about doing so, like Spirit says, is ready to offer you guidance. All it requires is an open mind and a request for assistance. You have to do what is best for you. Self-love and self-care above all else. What are the tarot cards for Gemini placement spirit? February 2023. Queen of Swords. There you go again. Open-minded, assertive, strong in your um in your female or feminine, sorry, strong in your feminine energy of um of your your strong in your feminine side of your energy, which is like being assertive and sharp, knowing that you deserve better. Eight of Swords, definitely being in your head, highly being in your head. And the hangman. So <laughs> you're very in tuned. So I don't know here. Like you, there's like, it's almost like you're in tuned like spiritually, right? But for some reason, you don't really know how to move from this spot. Like, I feel like you're stuck. I feel like you're trapped in your head. You're trapped with your physical body. Like you cannot move. At least that's how you feel. But it's like you can't because you won't stand up for yourself. You need to stand up for yourself. Temperance, balancing, moderation, Sag energy, eight of cups, walking away, letting go, ace of pentacles, new beginnings, and what? Self-care and self-love. Ace of, ace of passion, like, come on now, will of fortune. It says right here, flexibility is your forte. When life throws you a curveball, you can easily adapt to change, to new circumstances and find excitement in the unexpected change. Be brave and bold in your endeavors because the will of fortune says things about to switch up on you. And it's faded because you have such a strong drive or a strong desire for success. Queen of pentacles, you're just... You have this feeling of needing to be secure, like needing to make sure the people in your life, maybe even your children are secure, whether this is, whether you're a man or woman, it doesn't matter. Like this is, you're definitely in this, in your feminine energy though, whether or not you're a man or woman in a sense where spirit or, or you need to step more into it in a sense where you need to balance it with the masculine energy. Like, yes, things may be, may be logic and make sense. Um, but on the flip side of that, it's more so about making sure everything around you is taken care of or everyone around you is taken care of. And I feel like that part kind of like makes it where you carry other people's baggages or other people's weight and it's not necessary for you. Like you have a strong desire to kind of just make sure everyone's okay. And I think that that hurts you more than anything. And if this person or this situation or whatever this is, is not related to you as far as your child you should not be worried about it like that. Like, that's just ultimately why you're stuck. You're worried about someone else's well-being. What is the cosmic message spirit for Gemini placements for February 2023? What is the cosmic message spirit for, Feb for Gemini placements for February 2023? What is the cosmic message for my Gemini placements for February 2023? Sacred journey number 26. I'm telling you, it's it's about you. It's about you. I feel like you poured enough of yourself into somebody else or something else. Sacred journey. There is wisdom in knowing that even darkness serves its purpose in the growth of the soul. Darkness need not be feared, but simply understood. Darkness is a misunderstood energy which causes so much emotional distress and disharmony around the world as it is seen as something that is a separate to God. Most often it is seen as something that needs to be avoided and battled. Darkness too serves its purpose. Through darkness we come to see the light that is in us. We expand our conscious understanding through first walking in the shadows of our soul. The more you ignore, push away, and avoid darkness, the more it is attracted to your space. It is only through love and understanding of the true nature of darkness, embracing its role, and having gratitude for the lessons it teaches us that we are able to transcend its karmic will only then do we break free from its cycling challenges that trigger the soul through its many faces and forms darkness is here to help us find our way back into our heart we are all one good evil dark light and the many other labels mankind has used to separate this energy that is one do not fear the shadows within or outside you but simply observe the dance of life that is occurring all around you see the lessons that unfold from the dark periods in your life understand their meaning and purpose when you can transcend this illusion of, separ of separateness and judgment of all that is seen as dark, you transcend the illusion of suffering. Chill. 
The more you walk this journey with understanding and clarity, the more at peace you are with the world. You are then ready to enter realms of higher consciousness and increased light. Affirmation, I am triumphant in knowing that even darkness serves its purpose in the fruition of the soul. Associated chakras is the solar plexus. I'm telling you, it seems like whatever this is, it's kind of just like... It's held you back where like, I don't know, it seems like with this card, it's kind of saying that for you to embrace this experience more so as like, and like the opportunity to get through it and to find your way to what truly is for you. Like, like, like through the darkness, you'll find the light, like through the darkness, you can find the love, like through the darkness, you will see the truth. Like that's what, that's the vibe I'm getting here because Whatever, whatever this energy is, you've been kind of stuck here for so long that I feel like you have not paved, you have not walked, you have not, con like, you have not really, tr like, trucked through that darkness to get to the light. So, it's time. And Spirit says, if you're, you know, if you want some guidance, we're here. All you got to do is ask for it <laughs> and have an open mind. We're here to help. Like, what can we do to help you? So, there you go, Gemini. I hope you enjoyed your February 2023 reading and um, I will see you guys next month. As always, love you. Peace.